Good morning. How are you? What is your name? My name is Maria. Which country are you from? Maria. Which country? What is the name of your country? Which country are you from? The name of your country? Country, Bali. Huh? Bali. Uganda? You are from Uganda? Uganda, so? uh -huh. Uganda. Uganda. Where? Where, where, where? So, of course, to my amazing people, my name is Ed Godiambo and I am a freelance journalist from Nairobi, Kenya. There is a need of also uh, me personally, kujaribu kuzungumzia vitu mbazo personally, uh, ni vitu za maana sana. There is a video mbayo ni pata ikienda viral sana na nikaisi kwa mba nji kwa viema sana nikikaiti chini nikijaribu kuizungumzia kwa ni najua pia watu wengi sana ayezi kuinafanyika tu Kenya peke yake but kwa wale pia watu wale our neighboring countries kama vile uh, Uganda uh, majirani wetu kama vile watu wa Uganda kutoka Uganda na wale watu kutoka Tanzania waweza kuwa sometimes pia wanapitia haya changamoto so guys kama hujapata ku watch there is a video that i'm about just to play nataka mjaribu tukutazama hiyo video Muniambie kweli je what exactly is happening kwa sababu tunapotoka Kenya sometimes language bali eh yani mawasiliano maus, 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 ni kitu ya maana sana na je mtu anaweza zungumza ama mtu anaweza wasiliana na mwenzake kivipi na tunapotoka hapa sana sana tunapotoka hapa Kenya lazima tuwe tuna kidogo unajifunza Kiarabu kidogo unajifunza uh, kis, yani English kwa sababu sometimes ukienda huko the only two language ambayo unaweza pata kuzungumza hiyo ni Kiarabu ama ama English. Now, I just want to play for you a video upate kuona huyu mwanadada. Uh, anatoka Uganda lakini amepata kufika pale ofisini na mambo yamepata kuchemka kwani ajipaye aezi jieleza vizuri eh. Aezi jieleza there is a kind of skill so mwanadada ana lack. Just have a play like chukua tu muda wako jaribu tukutazama hii video. Imagine mtu ametoka tuseme sasa mtu ametoka Kenya anaenda anaelekea Saudi ajui hata english like conversation yake in english ni shida akienda the other side akiwa na shida atasaidiwa kivipi eh? atasaidiwa kivipi atasaidiwa kivipi so so far ameenda pale kwa muarabu aelewi kiarabu kuzungumza pia kwa english ni shida tatizo kubwa just angalia ni huyu alirudi ku ofisi but now I'll listen to exactly what is happening in the office Good morning. How are you? What is your name? My name is Maria. Which country are you from? Maria. Which country? What is the name of your country? Which country are you from? Name. The name of your country? Country Bali. Huh? Bali. Uganda. You are from Uganda. Uganda. So? Uh -huh. Uganda. Uganda. Mm -hmm. What is your age? How old are you? No. Mm. Uh, how old are you? Like 24, you are 25, you are 26. How old are you? 23. 23 years? Mm. Okay. Uh, are you married? You have baby? Baby, two. Two baby. Mm. You work before? Where? Baby. Where you work? Experience. Where? Experience like uh, clean French. You, you clean. Which country you work before? When into Shuguru Gabba? Shuguru. Mm -hmm. When into Shuguru Gabba? Shuguru, like a kid, you what? Yes, where you were before? Saudi? In Saudi. Come, Sana? Riyad. Huh? Riyad. How many years? Two years or two, one year? Two. Two years. Mm -hmm. What do you know how to do? What mm -hmm. can you do? Two into Arab Saudi. Like um, from name Zulu. Huh? Mm. Talk aloud, I didn't hear you. Mm. Sure, talk. What do you say? Like a mm. mm. cleaning mm. good. Cleaning like good. Cooker, cookers, hockey, which is good. Cookers, what, you, what can you cook? Like a nice good. Mm. More like a spirao. Like a boyero. Spirao, boyo is Uganda food. You don't know Arabic food, anything? 
But you can banana good. Which banana, you, you can cook banana for kids. Yeah. <laughs> See, uh, brother, yeah, my the husband says you can cook yeah, banana yeah, for yeah. children good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can cook banana pilau Uganda for good. Eh, baby, you work before in Saudi? Hmm? You know how to speak English? Small. Small. Mm. Are you a Christian or Muslim? Mm. Christian or Muslim? It's small in your heart. Hmm? It's Now, ukijaribu kutazama hiyo video, huyu mwanadada ni kama kuna shida kidogo, hakuna tatizo. When you look at hata mdomo, ukijaribu kuangalia mdomo wake ni kama alikuwa na issue fulani. Sometimes inaweza kuwa mali alikuwa ni kama wakupata kuelewana, mkono ikaje ikabidi wamepata kupigwa ama wamepata kutembelewa. Na wamepata kurudi pale kwa ofisi, eh? Now, shida tatizo kubwa sana and this one I think uh, should go to the Kenyan government and also the recruitment agencies ambazo tuko nazo hapa Kenya ni kwamba tafadhali, eh? We need uh, tunapenda watu tunapenda wasichana wetu tunapenda majua kwamba wanapata kujituma lakini tunapenda sana but communication ni kitu ya maana sana tafadhali kama msichana apate kuelewa Kiarabu tafadhali awe anaweza zungumza kwa lugha ya kimombo na zungumzie English anaweza anaweza ongea in English ni mtu ambaye anaweza tena sentence anaweza jeleza tafadhali it is now hard time also tunafaa kukaa chini hata wewe kama wewe ni mkenya and you are planning una plan to travel kutoka Kenya unataka kuela yani kuelekea kwa hizi nchi za Uarabu na kwa sababu unajua kwamba kwa kweli Kenya kuna kazi ni muhimu sana wewe binafsi ukae chini upate kujielewa vizuri ujaribu ku and also mimi naona hizi mashule ambazo wasichana wanapata kwenda hapa nchini Kenya it is a hard time also au binafsi wawe wakifunza wasichana uh, Kiarabu pia kidogo ndio upate kuelewa like if the training is to go for almost one month yo one month from the day ya kuanzisha hivi watu waanze kuelewa kufunzwa hata Kiarabu ndio maana wakienda kwa hizi nchi zingine that's why anani akitakikana German lazima atakuwa anajifunza Kijerumani eh? lazima uelewe Kijerumani hmm? ndio ukienda the other side you can communicate unaweza unaweza waongelesha hmm? so it, it's also hard time also is 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 hizi hizi shule ambazo wasichana wanaenda hapa nchini Kenya wanafaa wana wakiti chini waangalie kwa sababu hii ndio chanzo let me tell you guys msichana akimetoka hapa Kenya hmm? amelekea nje huko amepatana na shida eh? atajieleza aje tuseme mwarabu amemkosea amemfanyia kitendo anahisi kwamba si mzuri mwarabu the other side the only language wanaweza zungumza naye ni english inakuwa tatizo ile wakati sio sometimes baada ya kukwa ile nyumba ako na shida anata, anatamani kujieleza kwa mwajiri wake and aelewi we know some of these let me, let me, let me, hapa tufichi hicho chote tunataka tuzungumze hili kila mtu atupate kuelewana kwa sababu nikijaribu kuficha kitu baadaye watasema wao oh, nilipata kuficha hii hapana tunajua kwamba kuna watu wengine wanapata this opportunity but hawakupata kwenda shule mpaka kumaliza lakini wamepata chance hizi opportunity ya kuelekea wapi uh, ya kuelekea Saudi ama 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 Qatar ama wapi na hawezi zungumza in English tafadhali watu wajaribu kuelewa like just try watu kila mtu ajaribu kujifunza kuelewa English so that ukienda the other side mwarabu wako sasa hizi that's why mimi naweza sema it is good to have like a... so that unakuwa una na hizi unajua wakati watasema wewe ni mwezi you have still for me how will you defend yourself hawezi hata defend hawezi ji defend kwa sababu you lack like the vocabularies to use ile wakati au hata like au juu ya nini word in english unajua tu is me is my name my name is so and so ndivyo tu ndo naweza elewa i come from kenya my name is my, like mimi my name is zed godiamo i come from kenya i love work i know how to cook pilau i know how to cook banana now you see you can't make a statement tell them those people oh my name is so and so and everything that you guys are telling me you are accusing me falsely all of these i never did you know these are not i never i never did anything about them all of these are lies how will you explain yourself you stole from me you took my money from the, the store you you stole this money for me you are you are a thief you are a thief you are a thief call police you are a thief call police you are a thief how will you express yourself the police come and then you are a thief yes no you you are, 
You are a thief? You mean you are a thief? No. You are a thief? No. You mean you are a thief? Yes. Tayari ushajishika. Wewe ni mwizi. You are a thief? No. You mean you are you are not a thief? No. You see? Kuna kuna English nyingine zinaweza kuchanganya sana. But mimi naweza omba tu. Watu wajifunze lugha uwe uko tayari ukitaka ku travel you are in a position mtu akikuweka chini unaweza jeleza na unaweza pia kujitetea we mwenyewe because the moment umefika kwa nyumba ya those arabs umefika kwa ile nyumba it is either you and you yourself even the officers zizi unasikiaga tu huwa zinasaidia msichana kiwa tu hapa Kenya the only usaidizi hao watu wanakusaidia gharama ni kuwa hapa Kenya ndio kutravel the moment umepanda ndege akapiga picha akapeleka huko ukafika huko ukapiga picha kazi kwako it's either you ujitetee wewe binafsi imagine umeenda hizi process zote umekimbia kimbia kimbia umemaliza hizo process zote au uelewi english and this one is one of the causes of somehow uh, mistreatment ya wasichana sana wakiwa Saudi kwa sababu hauwezi jieleza hauwezi jieleza mwarabu anahisi kwamba oh anachoka na wewe kidogo kidogo amekwambia leta hii like hata in english uh, can you help me with that cup ume, ume delay I want you today when I come back the house is clean make sure you do this and that do this do the laundry uh, do the ironing I come in the evening work is done you don't understand amerudi nyumbani wewe kumbe hizi zenye aliongeza ongeza unadhani sio siku unapenda unazifanyanga sande sasa unaongoje hiyo sande ifike ufanye kumbe yeye alisema ufanye leo anakuja anaona ni kama utaki kazi wewe binafsi hauwezi jeleza mnaongeana na masaini sign kidogo ieleweki bado There is no flow of communication. Tena ni wewe unaonekana wewe mwenye shida ni vita tena. Unasikia kidogo kidogo amekasirika na wewe amekupiga. Guys, to avoid this mimi naweza waomba tu to avoid this the regulatory up, uh, system yenye tuko nayo hapa Kenya. We introduce Arabic language kwa wasichana ambao wanaenda like uh, Arabic mambo na Arabic language uh, 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 as a, as a, as a, as a, as, a, as, a, as a study ama watu wajifunze Arabic ama English kabla wajatoka Kenya ku travel kuelekea nchi za Uarabuni because the moment they travel and they don't understand exactly easy lugha they will not be in, in a position to defend themselves wakiwa kwenye shida how will you like umeona huyu msana venye anangangana how will akipatana na mtu ambaye anampeleka mbio 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 atajitetea aje atajitetea aje so guys before u travel before u travel tafadhali jaribu uelewe hata kiarabu moja mbili tatu unasikia jaribu uwe unaweza communicate in english these are some of the uh, like uh, the policies what unafaa kuweka pale unafaa ukuje unaweza ama if not possible i think it is also another time also watu wa consider watu certificate is kuwe ni mbili ama hata moja but mtu anaweza ongea in english ajieleze vizuri akiwa kwenye shida tafadhali i goes by the name of diamo and i am a freelance journalist from Nairobi Kenya it was just a point of concern about me hisi kwamba ilikuwa vyema sana nikuja kuelezea ndio kila mtu apate kuelewa yeah thank you guys meanwhile don't forget to subscribe to this an amazing youtube channel bye bye let's meet on our next video